Okay, so here's the front door. I'm at 46 Marilla Ave in Davis Shores. We're in a non-HOA neighborhood here. Ex-flood zone. Right off Inlet Drive, so you do have some views of the water. Just kind of show you out this front door. Got plenty of off-street parking to utilize. And it's a nice big front porch area. You've got the hurricane shutters here. Show you another view when you walk in. It's pretty nice and open. It was built in 1946. We've got two bedrooms and one full bathroom and 912 square feet of interior living space. This is bedroom number one, bedroom number two. We'll pop in here. This is a nice size room. Just for reference, we have a queen size bed in here, two larger nightstands and a larger dresser, and it still feels pretty spacious. Got the ceiling fan, they've upgraded all of the light fixtures in the property. <clears throat> So to my right here is the second bedroom. It looks like we have original flooring in here. Two big windows for natural light. This overlooks the backyard. Sliding closet door. And coming back out, we've got the bathroom, which was just upgraded. We've got the wood look tile on the floor. The vanity here, which kind of looks like a pedestal sink, but it does have the storage underneath, which is really nice. Beautiful tile in the shower. And there's some shelving here for storage. And just across the hallway here is another closet. So there's plenty of storage in this house. Right here, you've got the bar counter for some extra seating. Walking into the kitchen now. So it looks like these are original cabinets, but everything has been really well maintained. They upgraded the appliances. So the range and the fridge are all brand new stainless steel. Got the window peeking out to the back room there. Kind of nice to have this window here so nobody's ever excluded from the party. So again, this home is in an next flood zone. A lender would not require you to maintain flood insurance here. <clears throat> it has a brand new roof, new hot water heater, which is just over there. A new washer and dryer, which is actually out in this structure here. Looks like at one time it may have been a garage, not quite sure, but you have the French doors there and another side door there. You could easily make that into a guest house or a workshop, an art studio, extra storage, whatever. The house sits on 0.13 acres, so you have this pavered area right out here for some extra seating. And just through the fence there is actually uh, the water. So you have some water views, which is nice. They've made a little seating area here. The HVAC is sitting up high, even though we are in a flood zone, it's just kind of nice to have. They've also um, just done the interior and exterior paint. And then they put in all new impacts glass windows and the French doors here throughout the whole home. So quite a few big ticket upgrades. The house is really, really cute. Also just behind that storage shed, or excuse me, this other structure that I was just talking about. If you walk around the side of it, there's another <clears throat> smaller closet with a door that you can use for some extra seating storage. <laughs> okay. Just gonna walk you back through one more time so you can reacclimate yourself. Again, there's the bathroom, the room with the bunk beds, and original flooring and the other bedroom. 
And this is 46 Marilla Ave and Davis Shores.